Hey guys, welcome back to another video. In today's video, I am playing Windwalker Monk, so shout out to all the Windwalker Monks out there. If you did like today's video, then obviously make sure you leave a like and subscribe to the channel as it really does help me out. And yeah, let's jump straight into today's video. Hopefully you guys enjoy it. So guys, we're on our Monk today. I just made a big mistake. I wanted to try and do like a little weird build for you guys today. So I got my Pressure Points, Serenity, and then Eye of the Tiger, just swapping it out for my usual build. And I went to change my essences and look what happened. <laughs> God damn it. But hey, we're playing Vision Perfection, Conflict and Strife, Breath of the Dying. But I would have liked to put um, Crucible of Flame in there. But unfortunately, the gates opened too quickly and I couldn't do it. Um, but we've also gone with Open Palm Strikes and Pressure Point. Corruption. Only got legs here with Mind Flay. Shout out to the guy who told me to obviously play Mind Flay though. It was actually really, really good. Are we going to heal up first? And hopefully we can do some damage. Right, let's go. Okay. Oh, pressure. Okay, touch of karma could actually be good. Yeah. I, ju I just got so many touch of karma kills there. You see that? No, touch of death, sorry. I keep saying karma. I don't know why. Alright. I, I think I could do a lot of damage in today's episode. If I can get uh, Vision of Perfection procs, we could be very, very good. Going to run towards my team. Oh, it's just a shame though, guys, that unfortunately we couldn't get another essence in our essence slot. So if it keeps saying at the bottom of my screen here with this like pop-up icon saying that, you know, unfortunately we haven't put anything in, then I do apologize. <laughs> Alright, get on this guy. Start off with a lot of big damage. Can we, like... Alright, hold up. Now this guy's going to start running. But it's fine. He bashed me. I hate that he keeps popping up saying that my Heart of Azeroth has a unused slot. I know, like, Blizzard, I know it has an unused slot. You think I would have left it alone? <laughs> like, come on. Dude, I actually do a lot of damage with Serenity. Serenity could actually be very, very decent. I'm not even kidding. Like, obviously, if you don't play Serenity and play Whirling Gran um, Dragon Punch, you get, like, 30 to 40k AoE damage. Plus, you get two stacks of your Storm, Earth, and Fire, which is obviously really, really good. However, the only problem with that is it's hard. To, like, it's situational. Because if you want to play um, Vision of Perfection, obviously, you're going to do a lot of damage with your... Um, hold up, hold up. You're going to do a lot of damage with your uh, images which come out, which is really, really nice. But if you go with Serenity, you get that like 20% increased damage or whatever it is. So it could be the way. It's nice to experiment in Battlegrounds. That's what Battlegrounds are there for, is to experiment with new ideas. And if you have a certain build you want to try, then playing with um, different builds is actually really, really good to do. Insta kick that lightning lasso, you see that? Alright, I'm going to put Touch of Death on him, because if he falls but oh, I should have done the other guy, oh well. Um, if it falls below 10% HP, he dies, so. Remember that time in uh, Miss Pandaria where monks could just crush you with Touch of Death, like you'd be 15 or 20% HP and you just flop because it kills you instantly? That's basically what this spec is at the moment. I'm just going to... Thank you. <laughs> I was literally going to say, I'm just going to run for a second. This guy wants to get on me. Oh. Oh, thank you, man. <laughs> He's trying to chase me down. What a shame. His Azerite spike's trying to get me, and it just can't because I keep lining it. One thing I don't like about Monk, though, guys, is healing with your Vivify is so goddamn annoying. It's so frustrating because it does nothing, but Monks have so much mobility and they're just great. So, yeah, there's nothing you can do other than just... Oh, hold up. Just um, bask in the damage of Monks because they're so good. But yeah, hopefully everybody's having a solid day, though, man. He's trying to knock me off. You see that? I'm not stupid, dude. 
I'm re I'm really not stupid. Watch. I swear, I have like 500 IQ in this game. I just know when they're going to use an ability. Yeah, see you later. Oh, and I got a proc from my Serenity. So now our damage is actually increased. My bike's coming in. My bike's coming in. Oh, I crashed into the wall. Alright, I really want to get that, um, the buff, but I can't. Yeah, what I was saying before I got distracted, like I always do in every single episode. Sorry for this pop-up, though. It's really annoying me, too. Um, but that's nothing I can do there. Nope, you're not getting that buff. Yeah, what I was saying is hopefully everybody's having a nice day, and hopefully everybody's safe with this whole virus, man. Because at the end of the day, I just want everybody to get back to normal, and hopefully... Fingers crossed we can work towards finding a alternative method from staying inside all the time. But hopefully, like, it just clears out this virus and everything will be back to normal soon. So, I really do hope for, uh, hope for the best for everybody. But yeah, I'm playing Monk today, as promised. Like, I did promise everybody that I would... <laughs> I carbon him and then hit him and he died. Yeah, I did promise everybody that I would start playing all my ults again. So all I have left is this guy and then my balance druid and then we've done all classes again. So it's really, really nice. I wanted to try and do that because the people who's waiting for like a monk video or waiting for like a mage video or like a balance druid will obviously have these videos um, recent, like new. So instead of watching one that came out like two months ago, you'll have a fresh one um, which is just here for you guys if that makes sense. I just want to do an up-to-date PvP video on them so you don't have to wait for me to do another one. Come on. Screw it. I can Tiger's lost out of this. Didn't want to do that because I knew he was going to ice me. Dude, he's immune to my leg sweep. He must have been on DR then. Nice. Boom. Um. Okay. This guy, this guy likes getting on me though. There we go. Thank you. <laughs> I wanted to... You see that, guys? I wanted to um, paralysis the healer, and then he knocked me back, and I actually managed to dump and harm here. Oh, I'm dead. That's unfortunate. Okay, guys, so if you don't know what Serenity actually is, because this video is based around this new build... Um, don't, I wouldn't try this build, it's literally just something I went, oh, I like this spell, I like this spell, this spell could be good, and then, hey ho, here's the video from x this. But what I was saying is that, if you don't know what Serenity is, it basically like increases your damage by 20%, and it also um, well, it increases your healing and your damage by 20% for like a short period of time. And then if you don't know what the, uh, the um, pressure points does, it basically allows your karma to instant, no, your touch of death to instantly kill people um, on 10% HP. You see that? He instantly died, so it's really, really good. But Blizzard needs to fix that bug when you don't have a Heart of Essence um, like equipped. As in, like, if you don't have an Essence slot used, this, this bug needs to stop coming up because it keeps saying, oh, you have a slot, but dude, I physically can't enter it in the battleground, so... They need to sort that out so I don't have an annoying pop-up every single episode if I forget to pull it in. But it's okay. Nothing I can do there. I'm just going to have to keep clicking on the X. Hopefully you enjoy um, Monk though, guys. If you haven't already, then obviously leave a like on this video and subscribe to the channel for the Monk gameplay. And the sheer amount of damage I'm doing. Like, it's actually incredible. I am doing like 60k non-crits. Really, really good. Uh, I can actually get out of this. Stun this guy. Parrying his attacks. Um, okay. 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 I'm not going to die. Don't worry. I'm perfectly fine. I have karma up too. If I need it. Alright. So what we're going to do is kill this appendage. Pop Serenity. Fist of Fury. Now Serenity is good. Because obviously I'm playing with hit combo as well. So it gives me 6% increased damage. So realistically, I'm looking at an increase of 26% damage every time I burst. So it's very, very solid like for burst damage. And in this battleground, I thought it'd be the best time to try Serenity because of the orbs. And the longer the enemy holds the orb, the more damage they're going to take from me. So I just fig figured x Rathus coming in with that 2 million IQ, thinking of new builds to play. And so far, 
this build is actually okay. Like, sure, I think Storm Earth and Fire might be a little bit better because it's situational. Um, I don't know. Oh my god, that I'm telling you, these leg sweeps. Woo! But today, guys, this annoying pop up is going to be no more because this video has, in fact, ended. We managed to do 10 kills, which was second on the leaderboard. 6.4 million damage, which was average, and then 1.7 million healing. I would say that this was a successful video, um, because we tried a new build out. Like I said earlier, it's not a build that you should be trying. Um, hold up, let me sort this out. Because what my initial plan was to go these essences, you know, go Crucible of Flame for the extra damage. So I probably would have been on top kills and damage if I went with another essence slot. Um, because I would have been more focused instead of keep clicking on that pop-up. But I would say for Battlegrounds, like, point of view, this is actually quite good. Because I wanted to try with Eye of the Tiger. Because I know that Chi Wave is good and I like it because it bounces off enemy targets. And in the Battleground, that's ideal because everybody stacks up. But I thought Eye of the Tiger, if I go with that, it allows my Tiger Palm to obviously heal me constantly. And damage the enemy and then I also thought if I went serenity here my abilities are on a shorter cooldown therefore if I go with pressure points it's gonna allow me to get a shorter cooldown touch of death and I can kill people more rapidly if that makes sense because when they're on 10% HP they insta die so if I put it on when their targets 50% it has a better chance of killing them when they're low HP and it'd be a short cooldown. So that's what I was thinking. Um, don't know if it actually worked that well, but I actually like this build. It's, it's not entirely bad, but this is what I play normally. If you swap everything back to normal, um, this is what is my standard build. I'm always going to play this, but I might experiment with new builds. But guys, thank you for watching today's video. Hopefully everybody is safe, like I mentioned earlier. And I'm going to be bringing you a balanced steward PvP video either tomorrow or Wednesday. Could be Thursday, but it's going to be um, Tuesday or Wednesday because I'm working on my 2k sub montage. Hopefully, it's going to be out on the... On, no promises, it might be out on the 4th of April, okay? No promises though. I still got like, I'd say 50 or 45 seconds to go. And then I need to like fine tune everything and get it all up to like par. It's a montage, obviously a Destiny 2 montage. It's not like a proper montage, it's just like of just funny clips and stuff you know and sniper clips and all of that like it's, it's a different montage so i put my spin on it it's x this like y you know what to expect but guys thank you for watching today's video sorry for this outro being long if you did enjoy it then obviously leave a like comment down below and also subscribe to the channel click on that bell notification to know when i go live click on that bell notification to know when i post a new video that's what i meant to say and also let me know in the comments down below what your favorite battleground is in world of warcraft i think mine at the moment um temple of Co uh, Coke mongo whatever it's called uh is very very fun in this day and age of bfa silver shard mines used to be one of my favorites too it's still good but i don't know if demon hunters and that it gets a little bit annoying because everybody's stacked up but i would say my favorite of all time is definitely altarak valley but guys, thank you for watching today's video. I'll see you in the next one. So, peace!